Human beings are most creative during a crisis. Today, COVID-19 also will be the driving force behind science and technology. Digitalization is not something new, it's just pandemic accelerate the awareness. It's all driven by needs. A lot of people have this, this fear of touching physical cash, so adoption of wallet went up. So we saw a surge in the usage. Due to this uh, urgent need, the, the awareness suddenly has improved so much. Um, and also the willingness to adopt. Then we realised that it's actually not difficult. Yes. Within a day, yes. you can actually set up an online store <laughs> and start doing business. That growth in adoption in internet and e-commerce, right, equal, equate to about the last four years' growth That's combined. Right. The proposition right now is a lot of people are looking at the whole uh, cloud uh, facility to see how they can actually migrate their, their physical uh, storage all the way to cloud. Uh. So it becomes more accessible. A lot of people they say that if my whole office uh, get burned down, how they want the disaster recovery centers? But uh, that is so costly if that is on premise uh, system. But on the cloud, uh, it's easy to deploy the debt uh, with the so much cost they can save. And today, they are matching grant given by government. So if let's say it's a two thousand solution, you pay a thousand, the government put in a thousand, you have a solution you can run that allows you to, to sustain your business for the next one year. Certain state governments and, and Free Selangor and the city councils and all that, they came up with uh, new processes to really allow uh, the fast onboarding of, of merchants. So we did a lot of uh, uh, engagement with MDEX like, to also make sure uh, some of the, the merchants, they, when they upgrade the solution to port, new port system, digital port system and all that, they get to apply for the grant as well. The grant, the SME grant is good because that's a uh, if you give fish, I rather you teach them, teach them how to fish, then force them to, to to do a certain extent of the digital transformation. You see a lot more local, hyper local businesses flourishing. I think that would, that's a good sign. Uh, what is your take about the recovery of the economy? I think we are on the way of uh, coming back. I believe our businesses, uh, business communities are quite resilient and uh, they are finding ways. We are talking to investors a lot, and some of them, especially in the services side, say that actually hey, Malaysia is a good place for them to put their operation. Uh, number one, our people are more disciplined, and then our infrastructure is good enough to support. This one I'm talking about, Global Business Services, GBS. And we actually see jobs being created by all these uh, foreign investors, FDI, are expanding in Malaysia. Technology is the key that developed the civilizations and economy. Malaysia today, is we need uh, creativity, to turn the tide, to turn all the crises that, that we face today into opportunities. 